See, the environment is evolving in the past few years, especially because of the efforts of uh, Jahara and, and the previous Pasha team, because they, they kind of laid the foundation for the startup ecosystem. And then uh, we, I would say there are components that are there that are mature, but our population or our engineers are not mature enough to make full utilization of that ecosystem. And I've been facing that, a lot of other people have been facing that because there's a lot of uh, ingenuine marketing of uh, what problem they are trying to solve. And it is not really uh, uh, like most of the startups that we have seen and some of them have failed as well because they are not really yeah. solving a local problem or a global problem in the yeah. magnitude they should be solving. So even I would say when I did my first startup, I was like that as well. But when the reality hits you and and you lose a couple of million dollars, then you understand that, okay, things don't work like this in business. And the same goes for startup. So unless people realize that uh, they need to solve real problems, which, which will generate money for them and they have evidence for them, they cannot really scale it at a global level. What we really need is that we come up with products that are digital and that can go global. So most of the startups that I've seen in Pakistan uh, involve some sort of uh, physical interaction. Like, uh, for example, you need a bus, you need a bike, you need a car, you need some, some sort of physical uh, vehicle to generate revenue. Whereas the startups that we see from India or from Israel, they are 100% software based digital startups, the ones that have succeeded. And we have been talking about increasing Pakistan exports to $5 billion or, or $10 billion. Yeah. And, and struggling with that. Whereas if you study the model of Israel, they have 10 unicorns and 10 unicorns means $100 billion. So 100 billion. Why, why focus on a services industry that, uh, that grows at a very slow pace even from india we have uh, zoho crm and other products that yeah. product based revenue yeah so what we really need to do is uh, the startups should focus on solving global problem they should be software based and the marketing should be uh, like they should drive the marketing from somewhere like dubai or malaysia uh, because these two places have have the capacity or access to a lot of uh, other global uh, markets so you can have your development team, you can have your core team, you can have your legal structure, everything coming back to Pakistan, but you need to think global. And, and that is the advice I would give to anybody who is thinking to launch a right. startup from Pakistan. And, and I think that will work.